Hey everyone, welcome back to Coin Collector's Corner. Today, we're diving into the intriguing story of the 1989 No Mint Mark Lincoln Penny. Could this everyday coin really be worth millions of dollars? Let's find out. First, let's talk about the basics. The 1989 Lincoln Penny was minted in Philadelphia, which is why it doesn't have a mint mark. Philadelphia pennies typically don't carry a mint mark, unlike those from Denver, D, or San Francisco, S. So, why is there a buzz about this coin being worth a fortune? To understand this, we need to delve into the world of coin collecting and what makes a coin valuable. The value of a coin depends on factors like rarity, condition, and demand. Let's break these down. The 1989 penny isn't rare in itself, but certain era coins from any year can be extremely rare. An era coin might have a missed strike, double die, or other anomalies. Coins graded at higher conditions, such as mint state, MS, 67 or above, can be worth significantly more. Professional grading services like PCGS or NGC can authenticate and grade coins. Sometimes, specific coins become highly sought after due to market trends or collector interests, driving their prices up. Now, let's address the million-dollar question. Is a 1989 no mint mark penny worth millions? The answer is, not typically. However, certain rare error coins from any year, including 1989, can fetch high prices. For instance, a 1983 copper penny recently sold for thousands due to its unique composition error. In conclusion, while your 1989 penny might not be worth millions, it's always worth checking your coins for rare errors or high grades. You never know what treasure you might find. This coin value in market $1.5 million. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe for more fascinating coin stories and tips. And don't forget to leave a comment below if you have any unique coins or stories to share. We have an extraordinary story about a 1962 D Mint Mark Lincoln penny that's worth a staggering million dollars. Yes, you heard that right. $1 million for a single penny. Let's dive into what makes this coin so special. First, let's take a look at the history behind the 1962 D. Lincoln penny. This penny was minted in Denver and is part of the Lincoln Memorial Series, which started in 1959 and ran until 2008. The D. Mint mark indicates that it was struck at the Denver Mint, one of the major minting facilities in the United States. But what sets this particular penny apart from millions of others minted in the same year? The value of a coin can be influenced by several factors, rarity, condition, and unique errors or variations. In this case, this 1962 D penny is in pristine condition, graded as MS 67, mid-state 67, by professional grading services. Coins are graded on a scale from 1 to 70, with 70 being a perfect, flawless coin. A grade of MS-67 is incredibly high, meaning the coin has no visible marks or imperfections under magnification. Additionally, this penny has an unusual mint error. There's a rare double die obverse, where the images and inscriptions on the front side of the coin are slightly duplicated. These kinds of errors occur during the minting process and are highly sought after by collectors. Now, you might wonder, how can a penny with an error be worth so much? The answer lies in the combination of its rarity, the mint condition, and the demand from collectors. When a coin like this hits the auction block, the bidding can skyrocket, especially if collectors are competing for such a unique piece. In fact, a coin similar to this one recently sold for nearly a million dollars at auction. This demonstrates how the market values these exceptional coins. The allure of owning a rare piece of minting history drives prices to unbelievable heights. So, next time you come across an old penny, take a closer look, you might just find a hidden gem worth a fortune. Remember, always handle your coins carefully and consider getting them professionally graded if you believe you have something special. This coin value in market $1.3 million. Thanks for watching! If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more fascinating coin stories and tips. Hit the bell icon to stay updated with our latest uploads. And let us know in the comments, have you ever found a rare coin in your collection? 
we're diving into the fascinating world of coin collecting and exploring a very special coin, the 1968 Nomint Mark Lincoln Penny. The 1968 Lincoln Penny is one of the most sought-after coins among collectors. But what makes it so special, and why could it be worth a fortune? First, let's talk about mint marks. A mint mark indicates where a coin was minted. In 1968, pennies were minted in Philadelphia, Denver, and San Francisco. Coins from Philadelphia often do not have a mint mark. A no mint mark 1968 penny from Philadelphia is quite common. However, a few rare errors and variations make certain coins extremely valuable. Back in 1968, the U.S. Mint faced several challenges, leading to some unusual errors. These errors can include double dies, off-center strikes, and other minting mistakes. For a 1968 no-mint mark penny to be worth millions, it would need to have a significant error or be in an exceptional condition. Coin graders look for these rare features when determining a coin's value. Some error coins from 1968 have sold for thousands, even millions, at auctions. The key is rarity and condition. The better the condition, the higher the value. So, how can you tell if your 1968 no-mint mark penny is worth a fortune? Here are a few tips. Check for errors. Look for double dies, off-center strikes, and other unusual features. Examine the condition. A coin in mint condition is more valuable. Get it graded. Professional grading can authenticate and assess the value of your coin. Submitting your coin to a professional grading service like PCGS or NGC can provide a definitive assessment of its value. And if you're lucky, your coin could fetch a high price at auction, potentially reaching into the millions. This coin value in market $1.60 million inch. Remember, while finding a million dollar penny is rare, it's not impossible. Keep an eye out, check your change, and you might just strike it rich. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more coin collecting tips and exciting stories. We're diving into a truly exciting topic, the 1976 No Mint Mark Lincoln Penny. Could this coin be worth millions of dollars? Let's find out. First, let's talk about the basics. The 1976 Lincoln Penny was minted in large quantities. Most of these pennies were minted in Philadelphia, which traditionally didn't include a mint mark hence the no mint mark designation. But what makes a 1976 Lincoln penny potentially worth a million dollars? The answer lies in its rarity, condition, and sometimes errors. However, it's important to note that most 1976 pennies, even in excellent condition, are not worth more than a few cents. So, what sets apart the valuable ones? Condition is key. A coin in mint state with a high grade from a reputable grading service like PCGS or NGC, can fetch a higher price. But even then, a penny would need to be almost perfect to reach significant value. A mint state coin graded MS67 or higher can be quite valuable. Errors also play a crucial role. Some 1976 pennies have unique errors, like double dies, off-center strikes, or other minting mistakes, which can make them very valuable to collectors. However, a penny being worth millions is extremely rare. Typically, the most valuable Lincoln pennies are from earlier years, like the 1909 SVDB or the 1955 Double Die, but exceptional examples of 1976 pennies have occasionally reached impressive auction prices. In rare cases, exceptional 1976 No Mint Mark Lincoln pennies have been sold for significant amounts but these instances are extremely rare and typically involve unique circumstances. So, how can you tell if your 1976 penny is valuable? Check its condition, look for any errors, and consider getting it graded. Remember, while it's exciting to think about a million-dollar penny, most coins are worth only their face value or slightly more. This coin value in market $1.80 million. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video and want to learn more about coin collecting, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. Have you found any interesting coins lately? Let us know in the comments below. We're diving into the fascinating world of coin collecting, and we're focusing on one particular penny that could be worth millions, the 1970 D. Lincoln penny. 
That's right, this little penny with the D mint mark from Denver could potentially make you a millionaire. But before you start rummaging through your change jar, let's go over what makes this coin so special and what you need to look for. The 1970 D. Lincoln penny is generally not a rare coin. Millions of these were minted, and you can find them in circulation without much difficulty. However, certain 1970 D. pennies have a few unique characteristics that make them extremely valuable. First, let's talk about the key characteristics. The most important feature to look for is the small date variety. The 1970 D. penny comes in two varieties, large date and small date. The small date variety is rarer and more sought after by collectors. The difference is in the date itself. On the small date, the 7 is level with the other numbers, while on the large date, the 7 sticks out slightly higher. Additionally, on the small date, the 9 and 0 are closer together. Next, you want to examine the mint mark. The valuable 1970 D pennies will have a clear and well-defined D mint mark. Sometimes, an error known as a D over D or double die mint mark can increase the value even more. So, you've checked the date and the mint mark. What's next? Condition. The value of any coin is significantly affected by its condition. Look for pennies that are in mint state, with little to no wear and a sharp, clear design. Coins that are graded by professional services like PCGS or NGC and receive a high grade, such as MS65 or higher, can fetch top dollar. The combination of the small date, clear D mint mark, and high condition is what makes this penny potentially worth millions. But why are these pennies so valuable? The 1970 D small date pennies value comes from a combination of rarity, demand from collectors, and historical significance. The 1970s were a time of significant changes in U.S. coinage, and collectors are always on the lookout for unique variations. So, there you have it. The 1970 D Lincoln penny can be worth millions, but it all depends on those key characteristics. Small date, clear D mint mark, and excellent condition. Check your collections, search your change, and who knows? You might just strike it rich with a little penny. This coin value in market $1.70 million. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video and want to learn more about valuable coins, hit that like button, subscribe to our channel, and turn on notifications so you never miss an update. We delve into the story of a remarkable coin, the 1925 No Mint Mark Lincoln Penny that could be worth millions. Hello, coin enthusiasts. I'm your name, and in today's episode, we're uncovering the secrets and the incredible value behind one of the most sought-after coins in American numismatics. The Lincoln Cent, first minted in 1909, has become an iconic piece of American history. Among these, certain years and varieties have turned out to be extraordinarily valuable. The 1925 No Mint Mark Lincoln Penny is one such coin. So, what makes the 1925 No Mint Mark Lincoln Penny so special? Let's break it down. This penny was minted in Philadelphia, as indicated by the lack of a mint mark. The obverse features the familiar portrait of Abraham Lincoln, designed by Victor David Brenner. The reverse displays the classic weed ears, a design that was used until 1958. The key to this coin's immense value lies in its rarity and condition. While millions of these pennies were minted, very few have survived in mint state condition. Those that have are highly prized by collectors. Recent auctions have seen these coins fetch astonishing prices. For instance, a 1925 No Mint Mark Lincoln penny in pristine condition can be valued at over a million dollars, depending on its grade and eye appeal. Grading is crucial in determining a coin's value. The Sheldon scale, which ranges from 1 to 70, is used to assess a coin's condition. A higher grade indicates a better preserved coin. For the 1925 penny, grades above MS65, mint state, are where the value skyrockets. When examining a 1925 penny, look for sharp details, minimal wear, and vibrant color. These factors greatly influence its grade and value. Finding a 1925 no mint mark Lincoln penny in your collection could be like winning the lottery. If you think you have one, get it authenticated and graded by a reputable service like PCGS or NGC. This coin value in market $1.30 million inch.
Thanks for joining us on this exciting journey into the world of rare coins. If you enjoyed this video, please like, share, and subscribe for more fascinating stories from the numismatic world. And who knows, maybe you'll discover a hidden treasure in your own collection. We're diving into the fascinating world of the 1961 No Mint Mark Lincoln Penny. The Lincoln Penny has a rich history, first minted in 1909 to commemorate the 100th anniversary of Abraham Lincoln's birth. Over the years, it's become a staple of American currency, with collectors constantly on the lookout for rare and valuable editions. Now, let's focus on the 1961 No Mint Mark Lincoln Penny. At first glance, it might seem like any other penny from that era. But what makes this coin so special? The no mint mark simply means it was minted in Philadelphia, as they did not include a mint mark on their coins back then. However, it's not just the absence of a mint mark that makes some pennies exceptionally valuable. For a 1961 penny to be worth millions, it would need to be in pristine condition, known as mint state. Coins in this condition are incredibly rare and sought after by collectors. Grading agencies like the Professional Coin Grading Service, PCGS, and the Numismatic Guarantee Corporation, NGC, grade coins on a scale from 1 to 70. A 1961 Lincoln penny in a high grade, say MS67 or above, could fetch a hefty price at auction. In fact, certain high-grade Lincoln pennies have been known to sell for thousands, even millions of dollars at auction. But it's not just the grade, it's also about rarity, demand, and sometimes, even a little bit of luck. Imagine discovering one of these rare pennies in your collection. It's every coin collector's dream. But remember, while some pennies can be extremely valuable, it's important to manage expectations and get your coins properly appraised. If you think you might have a valuable 1961 Lincoln penny, consider getting it graded by a reputable service. Their expertise will give you a clearer idea of its value and condition. This coin value in market $1.3 million. Who knows? Your next penny could be the one that changes everything. Keep hunting, and happy collecting! If you enjoyed this video and want to learn more about rare coins and their fascinating stories, hit that subscribe button and follow us on social media. We're diving into the intriguing world of coin collecting and uncovering the mystery behind a 1988 D Mint Mark Lincoln penny that could be worth a million dollars. That's right, folks. A simple penny from your pocket change could be worth a fortune. But what makes this particular penny so special? Let's break it down. First, let's talk about the mint mark. The D on the penny indicates it was minted in Denver. While millions of these pennies were produced, certain unique characteristics can significantly increase their value. The 1988 D penny you're looking for has a very specific feature known as the reverse of 1989 variety. This means the design on the back of the penny has subtle differences compared to other 1988 pennies. The key difference lies in the initials FG on the reverse. The style of these initials can help determine if you have the rare variety. Here's a tip. Use a magnifying glass to closely inspect the FG initials to see if they match the style used in 1989 pennies. If they do, you might just have a rare penny in your hands. Now, let's talk about the value. Why could this penny be worth so much? Well, coin collectors highly prize errors and varieties, and this particular variety is incredibly rare. Some collectors are willing to pay top dollar, and I mean top dollar, to add it to their collections. In fact, a 1988 D. Lincoln penny with the reverse of 1989 variety in excellent condition has been known to fetch thousands, and in exceptional cases, potentially even more. While a million-dollar sale is rare, the right buyer and the right conditions could make it possible. So, how can you check if your penny is worth a fortune? First, get your hands on a good magnifying glass or a coin microscope. Inspect the FG initials on the reverse side. Compare it with images online or reference guides to see if it matches the 1989 style. If you think you've got a match, consider getting your coin graded by a professional service like PCGS or NGC. They can authenticate and grade your coin, which can significantly increase its value. This coin value in market $1.4 million. And there you have it. A simple 1988 D penny that could be worth a million dollars. 
so, start checking your change and see if you have a hidden treasure. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more exciting coin discoveries. Thanks for watching, and happy hunting!